Now here's an interesting exercise involving maneuvering speed. Maneuvering speed here is shown to be 103 knots. But that's only good at the aircraft's max gross weight. So if we were to take 2,400 pounds and fly the aircraft all the way up to 100 knots, it's going to be fine until we exceed maneuvering speed, at which time we'll get structural damage as we enter turbulence. Now, when we decrease weight, say we burn off fuel, we burned off a lot of fuel, it actually gets worse. So, let's try to go through here at 90 knots. I'm still exceeding structural weight. When I decreased my weight 400 pounds, I had to decrease my airspeed from 105 to 85. And this continues. If I decrease my aircraft weight further, even 85 knots will cause structural damage. I have to slow considerably down to 80 knots. The aircraft becomes much more susceptible to the angle of attack change from turbulence as your weight decreases. This may be counterintuitive, but it's a good thing to remember.